Investigate pumpkins. What's inside a pumpkin? There's one way to find out. Open it up and investigate. When you investigate, you ask questions and explore. Feel the gooey pulp. The pulp is wet and stringy. It holds pumpkin seeds. Now you might be wondering, how many seeds are in a pumpkin? First, look at the lines on the pumpkin shell. For every line, there is a string of seeds inside. Then you can count each seed. But it might take a while. Some pumpkins have hundreds of them. Here's another pumpkin question to investigate. Are all pumpkins the same? Let's look. Pumpkins can be bumpy or smooth. They can be round like a ball or tall and skinny. How else are they different? Pumpkins come in different colors, such as green or red. There are about 40 different varieties or types of pumpkins. This kind of pumpkin is called a cotton candy pumpkin. It is big and white. This pumpkin is a blue Gerardelle. It has a blue shell. Pumpkins also come in different sizes. The Jack B. Little pumpkin is so small, it can sit in the palm of your hand. But an Atlantic giant pumpkin can weigh more than a cow. Which brings us to another question. Do you think a small pumpkin will float in water? Let's investigate by testing it out. Yes, a small pumpkin floats. But what about a giant pumpkin? Believe it or not, giant pumpkins float too. People even make boats out of giant pumpkins. In fact, people have a lot of fun with pumpkins every autumn. They paint pumpkins and carve them. They show pumpkins and throw pumpkins. Zoos even give pumpkins to animals to play with. That's how fun pumpkins are. But here's one final question to investigate. What happens to pumpkins when all the fun is done? Leave a pumpkin out and over time you'll see.